Hey everyone, Professor Michael Scanlon here. Let's talk reactivity, right? So you might have seen some videos where people take metal sodium or sodium metal, and which is really soft, and they throw it in some water and it blows up, right? Why does it do that? It's highly reactive. Why is it so highly reactive? It's electrons. So you get reactions, and I'm oversimplifying pretty much all of chemistry, so I apologize to all the chemists out there. You get reactions because of electron interactions, right? So if you look at your periodic table, that first column, called a group, that first group all have one valence electron or one outside electron. They want to get rid of that because if they can get rid of that, then their outer shell is then stable. Sodium is a very common demonstration, I guess, but it's not the most reactive. In fact, it's one of the least reactives. As you move farther down the table, the activity increases. I had some cesium, that would be pretty epic, boom. I don't, neither do I have sodium. I've got potassium for you. So if you look at the periodic table, you've got hydrogen on the first top part, then you've got lithium, then you've got sodium, then you've got potassium all going down that first row. I've got some metallic potassium and I'm gonna put it in water and we're gonna watch it react. Do not try this at home. It's okay if you put a banana in water. That's not going to hurt anything. Don't do it with metallic potassium. Now when I do this, the potassium is going to react with the water and form potassium hydroxide, which is a base. Now, we've talked about acids and bases before, and I've got an indicator that will let me know if I've made an acid or a base. Now I'm going to move fast because so I would go see. Get off. Get off. Seriously. Hey, it's purple for NSU. So I should have done this under a fume hood. That's why you never do it at home. I'm going to take my indicator now. I don't think this is going to be very basic at all, but we're going to see, and I'm expecting a color change. We'll take a look at it. Oh, yeah. It's got this nice color change. So, I don't have a made a base, which is caustic. I got to blow something up. Well, purple flame. I mean, who doesn't love a purple fire? I'll see you in the next video. Don't try this at home. Stay safe, everybody. Orkham Demons.